From me, Shepard, Shepard, you. Hmm. Okay. Uh, we're up to uh, Super Staff Chav Kemo. We're starting Daf Chav Pays, three lines to the bottom. Yesterday, we, we saw a very interesting uh, din, halacha, if two people say that that uh, you were, you were that your husband died, right? You shouldn't get married. If you get married, you don't have to leave. Two people said your husband got divorced, uh, that you divorced. The two people said you didn't get divorced, you shouldn't get married. And in fact, right, if you do get married, then take say you should leave. Uh, we saw different, different opinions, three different opinions. So a buyer's opinion that's two versus one, one versus two. We'll see that again today. We saw Rava that she's she's going to check it very well when her husband dies because if he shows up, she has no excuse. My thinking by Gerishin, if he shows up, she could tell me that she was divorced. Right? And then finally we saw that it, immediately, what happened immediately, he died. It could be the body is eaten up by lions or drowned. But if immediately if you got divorced, where's she get? So now, Tanur Rabbanan, along the, continue along, along those themes. Tanur Rabbanan, three lines from the bottom. Shnayim Omer Neskatcha, two people said you, you accepted Kedushin from a man. Shnayim Omer Neskatcha, and two people said you did not. Harizula Tina says she should not go ahead and mod and get married to, right, to, to another person. Obviously, La'acher to, to another person. To the men, they said that you were Neskatcha too. She could, of course, get married. The Nisei said, if she does get married, Lo Yisait say, similar to Misa, like yesterday in the bright in his statement regarding two who ate him on Misa and two ate him on Gerishin, the same din by Gerishin. And now we have to ask the same question. Why by Misa do we say you, you don't have to leave? And why by Gerishin? Yes. Over here, why by Kedushin? Don't you have to leave? And by Gerishin? Yes. So this similar, very similar uh, format of Gemara. The Misa states, I'm an Aleph. Maishna Reisha, Umaishna Seifa. What's the difference? The Reisha, where you said that what you're going to, get, you you got married, you don't have to leave. If you Mashna the Seifa, where Gerishin you do. What's the difference? Says Gemara. Amar Abaya says um, Abaya. Amar Abaya. Uh, Avi were on Chafkim Alamad at the top. Amar Abaya Tirgema. The difference is Be'ed Echad. Again, similar, say like yesterday, it's speaking by an Eidecha. This is a bias, same terrorist that he gave yesterday. Okay, let's go through it now. Eidecha, I'm in One eight said that what? You accepted Kedushin from a man. And another other eight said, Loi Niskasha. Shravayu b'penuya kamasade. They both said that she was a penuya. One says she's Mekudeshes. And one said she's not Mukudeshes, but both in agreement, they're coming from a place that she was a, a free woman. So you have two people that said she was a free woman. The one that says she's in is, is, is one. So it's two versus one. And therefore, therefore, yes, I'd say, I'd say, I keep on saying the same thing. Therefore, I'd say, right, you don't have to leave. It was the exact same terms we gave yesterday. So obviously he said that she was an Aces Ish, correct? When it says Niskarsha, meaning she was an Aces Ish, because you're coming from a, a place of Chazaka being an Aces Ish, and you're saying you're divorced. You're not divorced, and you're still an Aces Ish. They're both agreeing that the place she's coming from is that of being an Aces Ish. Why is she saying this Garsha? That's the difference why by Gerishin Tetze, because she was uh, coming from a place of being Ashish Ish, and by Niskatsha, you could stay together. It's speaking, you don't have one aid, it's speaking, you have two. Two said you're married, two said you're not. Two said you're divorced, two said you're not. The Eipach, but switch around. By Kedushin, you, you, you have to leave. And by Gerishin, you could stay together. So switch around the Psak. Two Adam said you're Niskarsha, two Adam said you're Niskarsha. You shouldn't get married. If you get married, switch it around. Tate say, leave. Two people said you're divorced, two people said you're not divorced, right? Don't get married. And, and But if you do, Lai say, say. So switch around the Psak. And what happened? Shnai Yomer renewed the Niskarsha. Two people said we saw that Wat Niskarsha. Shnai Yomer Loi renew, we didn't see. Shen Niskarsha. How is Loi Tinase? Then he says, Tetzay, right? Says, and, and she has to leave. Why? Because two people say Niskarsha. You don't have two, two people saying you weren't Niskarsha. You have two people saying it's not Trey versus Trey. You have two people. Says, 
You don't have two verses, two. One saying, we saw you in the And one says, we didn't see you. So good, you didn't see. But ain't a kanami. So like, you know, ain't a raya. So it's more like, tzricha, the diary b'chatz recha. Guys, we're going to, what's called an umdina. An umdina means, you're going to ahead and say, speak in a specific instance. The two people who said, they're all, they live in one chatzar. And they said, listen, you figure in a chatzar, if you got engaged, you got married, there'd be a, we'd know about it, right? So it would substantiate the fact that what they're telling the truth that it should get engaged because the close close proximity of of a simcha people would know about it. So therefore, late tzricha the day bechatzer echad ma'u the tema emisa the neskatcha. In fact, she got kedushin kala isle. There would be a wad a a a a, a, a kala shtima. There would be whole uh, news about it. Kamash malon the of the inshi the mekadesh b'tzina. A person goes ahead. What is mekadesh b'tzina? Therefore, Tetze, in other words, we have two Aiden that she was in Skarsha. We don't have any Aiden that she wasn't. We have, we have a, 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 a Reglion Ledova. We have a situation that would substantiate that she wasn't. But nonetheless, we don't have anything. Mamela, it makes sense, Tetze, because why? Because you were in the Scottish to another man. Conversely, the other way around, Seifa, by, by Gerishin, we're going to say, you don't have to leave. You know why? We saw that you got to get. Don't get married. Even though they live in the same chutzer, it's the exact same case as we know. People are Makadish Bitsina. If she got divorced, it will be well-known news that she got divorced, and therefore I would say she can't get married. She would have to leave. Kamash Malon, the Ovenin, she the Makashe, and Magashe Bitsina, both of them Bitsina. Very well, she's divorced. Therefore, they say say. So by Kedushin, guys, we'll say she's Ms. Kudeshes. If she's Ms. Kudeshes and she gets married, leave. On the other hand, Ms. Garsha will say she's talking divorced. The male, if you get if you get married, because again, we spoke about the Pasuk, you want to be, as we said yesterday, squeaky clean. You want to avoid any, any point of rumors or anything. So don't. But in fact, if you do, according to Rav Ashi, you could stay together by Gerish and by Kedush and you leave. Okay. The Mishnah said, again, go, going, going back to Mishnah, Mishnah was, a woman says what? On Chafez of an Aleph, I was a Eshesish and I was a Grusha, Tesha Asa, Aidim, that lot. She says, in Nisas, then you have, she said she was captured. She gets married. So now, what's the case over here? Says the Gemara. And he says, Bo Aidim Loisaitse. Why? Okay. Ravashia Masnila Resha. Again, there's two dinim in the Mishnah, guys. The first dinim in the Mishnah is Gerishin, and the second dinim in the Mishnah is being captured and being Tamea. For a kayin, correct? Those are the two echetimses. One, I'm a get. I, I was a gerusha. I was nation's gerusha. Pesha asa. Aidan come say you you what? You were you were. Aidan come and say we don't we don't need you anymore. Aidan come and says that what she was nation's ish. The second case is what? Aidan come and say you were captured. Good. Now, the the, the there's a clause at the end of the mishnah, and if you get married, let's say say. What is that clause going back on? Is it going back on the first case or the second case or both? Right. So is it going on the Gerishin case and the and the Nishbis case? Or is it only going on the Nishbis case, but not the Gerishin case? Okay, bear in mind, we saw yesterday a, a, a case of Ram Nuna that an Isha tells her husband, you divorced me, she's believed. Why? Because a woman will not have the chutzpah to go and say in front of her husband that you divorced me if, in fact, you did not. Right? You wouldn't have that chutzpah. You, you wouldn't have the chutzpah to say that. And that's Rav Hamnuna Shita. Says the Gemara. The Imli Shani says, Bo Aiden Loi Say Say. Rev Aishia Masnin La Aresha. Rev Aishia said, This is going on the Resha. It's going on the case of Gerishin. In the case of, if you said Aisha Sisha, but now I'm a Grusha. Aiden come along and said, You're an Aisha Sish. If she gets married, Loi Say Say. Good. Aresh. Rabba Ravavin Masnin La Seifa. On the case of what? If you, you were captured and you're Tahira. Mind the Masnin La Aresha. The one who says it's going on the case of Gerishin, Kol Shekena Seifa. By Gerishim, we're going to say that what that a woman, right? A, 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 by by Shvuyan in general, we're more makel. And here, by a woman, by divorce, if you're going to hold like Reb Nuna, if by divorce, right, you're going to say that what that 
that she doesn't have to leave, then by Shvuya not. The Gemara fears us. The Bishvuya Hekilu by Shvuya we make them. So therefore, if by gay regime we're going to say you could stay together, certainly by which you said you were captured, and we're going to be makel and saying that you were tahar, you will not be have to leave your Korean husband. Umanda Masne Asefa, however, the one who learns it on the Sefa, right? In other words, Rabbi uh, Robin, uh, Rabbi Barovin, Avala Reisha Loi. But the Reisha, he would say they ha- she has to leave. Why? Why, why, would he ha- why would he not learn it on, on the, why not on the Reisha? Why not? Lema, the reason we be the Rav Nuna commitfully, they're arguing in what? In Rav Nuna. Again, what does Rav Nuna say? That a woman would never have the chutzpah to say in front of her husband that she's divorced unless, unless, unless she wasn't. Okay? The man, the Masnid La Reisha, Reboisha, who said that the statement of the Mishnah, if you get married, you don't have to leave, is going on the case of Gerishin, is slayed Rav Nuna. He holds like Rav Nuna. Therefore, if she says she was divorced, it must be she's divorced because she wouldn't have the chutzpah to say not. However, Rabbi Bar Oven, who said it's going on the safer, the case is Shvuya, but a less lady Rav Hamnuna does not hold it Rav Nuna. So, in other words, she would go ahead and have the chutzpah to tell her husband's not divorced. And therefore, Tate said you'd have to leave. Says the Marloi. That's not as far as the Machlaikis. The Machlaikis between Rav Oishia and, and Rabbi and, and Rabbi Bar Oven is not contingent upon whether they hold it Rav Hamnuna or not. The Kuli Alma is the Rav Nuna. Everyone says, like Rav Nuna, that a woman would not have the chutzpah to go ahead and say in front of her, her husband, you didn't divorce me. So what's the Sfar HaSamachloikis between Rav Oishia, who says that it's going on the Reisha, and Rav Oven, who's saying it's going to Sefer. The Masa of Rav, Rav, Rav Oven holds Ki it Mad Rav Nuna. When do we learn Rav Nuna's case? The fun of. It's only when the husband is there. Then she wouldn't have the chutzpah. When the husband's not there, she would have chutzpah. So a male woman can come and say what? She can say, you see, the Gerusha and I'm a Gerusha. So I agree with Rav Nuna. You know why she's saying a Gerusha now? Because Rav Nuna said his din in, 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 the, in the husband's presence. The husband's not around. The Masava, where Rosh says no. She lay before of Nami and A woman will never have the chutzpah to say she's divorced. In fact, she wasn't. So therefore, Rav Oishia said it's going on the safer, the case of what? Of being captured. And Rav and Rav uh, and Rav Rabbi Barovin saying it's even going on the ratio. It's even going on the ratio. That's the two shivas. Now, if Mishani says Bo Adim, if after she gets married, Adim show up, she what? She doesn't have to leave her husband. Yeah. So usually it's very interesting. The more usually doesn't double down. It's doubling down on the same clause. Ama Avu de Shmuel, father Shmuel says Le Nisais Nisis Mamish, right? So when it says Le Nisais, doesn't mean Nisais Mamish. That the mamas get married. Once Bezdin, we had this in, in Yavamis. Once the Bezdin said you could get married, in other words, you don't need to physically to get married. Even if Bezdin gave it a heter and then the Adam showed up and said, Your husband is what? Is, is, uh, you were captured or, you, or, you, or you're not divorced. If the Adam showed up that you were an ish, nonetheless, what? She would be able to marry based upon the heter. Fred the a seitze means it's mashma, you're in a state of marriage, guys. It's mashma, you're in a state of marriage. And loy seitze do not leave from that state of marriage. It means don't go ahead and from the original heter. In other words, it doesn't mean from the marriage. It means don't leave the original heter that we gave you. So once they got the heter to marry, then you're permitted to stay, stay married. Tanra Umra Nishbesi Utahirani. Woman says, I was captured, but I'm still Tahar, I'm not a Zaina, and therefore I can marry a Kayain. And I have Aidim that I'm Tahar. We don't say Namte Machio Aidim. We don't say wait for the Aidim to come. Ella Matirna Samiyat. Why? There's a Pesha Asa who a Pesha hit. The guys go always remember. If there's no one else except her, she has the power of the Pesha Pesha Asa. Pesha Asa or Pesha hit there. He too, he too really not say if Bezdin went ahead and they said she can get married, the Akakakbo Adam, and then Adam come, the Omru, and they say, Lo Yodanu, we don't know anything whether she's Tommy or not. So she says she has Adam, and the Adam show up and say, We don't know, but she got the heter already. Harizulo say she doesn't have to leave from that he- heter. She doesn't have to leave from that heter. The Mbo Ede Tuma, 
But let's say Adam come and say more than that she was captured. Adam say that she actually had been violated. Then I feel yesh to come upon him to say it's safe. Even if she was married to this Kayane, she would have to leave and leave a bunch of Khalalim in her wake, right? Or whoever, no matter all these children would be Khalalim. They won't be Mamzerim, right? She's married to a Kayane. She's not an Asha Sish. This is this, the latter case where she's saying she was what? She was defiled. She's a Zaina. And therefore she came out of Kayane. We know from Masef the Yavamis, right? That what? In this scenario, that the child's a Khalal. Okay. Now, very, very interesting Gemara. So what do we just say? We said, if she beats the Adam to the punch, then she has the Pesha Asa. And even if the Adam come afterwards, once she got the Heta, she got the Heta, correct? You know, do you hear what you're saying? Once she got the Heta, she got the Heta. Once you're Samyuk on a Pesha Asa, even if Adam come along afterwards and destroy a Pesha Asa, it doesn't make a difference. Once we listen to her. Listen to this case, guys. Hani Shivyasa the Asal Nadoi. Unfortunately, these women who were captured, they came to the town of Nadoi for pidyon shvuyim. What the goyim would do, they would capture and enslave them and bring them around for to get some money. That's the way. That was a, one of the ways they did business in those days. Kaviyachol. Oisiv Avu the Shmuel Nituri Badayu. The father of Shmuel, he placed guards over these shvuyim that they shouldn't be what that, that the goyim won't be able to get to them. So Amalei Shmuel, Shmuel told his father the Arva Idna Manatrenu, and until now, who was guarding them? They had been in the you know, what are you gaining, you're saying? They've been under the jurisdiction of the Goyim until now. What are you gaining by pu putting guards there now? So Amalei, so the Abu the Shmuel told him, Ilu binasach Havayin. If these were your daughters, Mihavi Mizal Zabe Kuli Hai, would you treat them so cheaply that you weren't on a Shmira? And listen to this, unfortunately, Havi Kishkoga Shiyatsim of Nei Hashali. It's like a, a it's like a shkaga that, that comes out from a ruler. In other words, a ruler says something, not meaning it to come to fruition, but unfortunately it does come to fruition. The Ishtaboyim bin Seyde Shmuel, and unfortunately Shmuel's daughters were captured. Abu the Shmuel's granddaughters were captured. Vasiknul Arad Yisrael, they were taken from Babel to Yisrael. And again, Shmuel was in Surah, guys. He was in uh, No, Arav was in Surah, Shmuel was in Pumpadisa, right? And now they took these daughters up to Eretz Yisrael and they were bringing them for pidyon. So what happened was these girls, you know what they did? They left the Goyim outside and they ran, they entered, this, they came to the Yeshiva Reb Chanina for Psak. Each one said that I was Nishbesi and I'm Tahar. So each one had what? A Pesha Asa. Each one had a Pesha Asa. Again, by leaving the, the people who captured them outside, Besdin had no idea the status of these girls. So they, obviously they were Tamidi <laughs> Chachamim. So what did they do? They went in by leaving them outside. So if they would show up with the Goyim, they wouldn't have a Pesha Asa because Besdin would know that they were captured. But what did they do? They ran into the Besdin before they, before they can ascertain what they were, and they created their status by saying, we were captured by we were tar. Oh. Sharinu, what happened? So Rabbi Chinina said, guess what? You can marry Kahanim. Saif Oluwasa Shivnaisu, what happened? The Goyim came in. Am Rabbi Chinina, binon de marayinon. Ah, these girls... <laughs> these girls, they're the children of a Bararayan, they're the children of a Samar, a big Talmud Chacham. Igloim also, they didn't say to my Shmuel Abbe, it became known that they know the father was fact, the God Ladar, Shmuel. Amalei Reb Chanino, Reb Shemin Bar Abba, Poik Itabel Bekor Vesecha. So Reb Chanino told Reb Shemin Bar Abba, who was a Koyen, go and take care of your relatives. Go and marry them. In other words, because they believed. So Amalei Reb Chanino, that they were captured. They, they, they were Adem. So, so Rabkhina said to him, Hash to me a lesson who come, I did not hear. Adem bitsad istan. If there are Adem in the istan in the north, the Teyasa, should we go ahead and ask them? As long as the Adis doesn't show up, we don't care about hypotheticals or even, even not hypothetical. If, 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 if we know the court knows their their status, Makmish their own pet, you have a pesha also a pesha. Fabulous, fabulous Gemara guys. Man, the koyach of psak guys. You hear this? You hear this? 
the Pesha Asa, I feel they even come afterwards. Once they got the Heta to marry, this Gemara substantiates the Pesach and the Mishnah. It doesn't mean you actually have to get married. Even you got the Heta, Rabbi Hanina gave him the Heta, that was enough. And not even though afterwards they found out that, that they were fat, in fact captured because they showed up, no difference. Timer Loyas Aiden. The reason is the reason why is because the Aiden didn't come. Right. Mr. Robert Aiden would come with Yasa. I've a Rudy Shmuel, Kimisha Tirili Nase, Afa Pishla Nises. One second. Mashma the Aiden in the north. If the Aiden were here, they wouldn't be believed. But one second. Mashma, they would show up. They would be believed even after the Heta. So, guys, what kind of Aiden we're discussing? Two possibilities. Aid Aiden that they were captured, or Aid them that in fact they were violated. And for the Gemara, Amr Ravashi, Aide Tuma Itmar. We're not speaking about Aiden they were captured. We're speaking about Aiden that they were violated. They knew for sure that they were not that they were Zionists. So very Gishmak. Enochinami. Aidim Shfuyin, once we get Petasha, Pesha hit there, we don't care. And even if there are Aiden that show up, if these Aiden show up and say they were captured, we don't care. Aidim show up and say they were Tomei, that's not what she said, because they said to Hairani, you have Aidim to Aidim saying the opposite of them. Okay. So we're not speak, so we're not sp- speaking about Aidim Tuma, they would be believed. But Aidim that are Tahar, then what that, that they were captured, then we would be Samachana Peshasa. Very Gishma. Very Gishma. Okay. Amid base. Shtei Noshim Shed Nishpu, two women that were captured. Zoisei Meres Nishbesi, Vita Hairani. This one says, this one says that what? That I am Tahar. The Zoisei Meres Nishbesi, Vita Hairani. Each one says they're Tahar, Ani. Now, you'll hear it's a Peshasa, right? Ain't in their menace. They're not believed. Look at Rashi, guys, important Rashi. Sheyesh Edim Shinishpu. Why did Rashi have to say that? Because without that, you'd have the Pesha Asa, they would be believed. Okay? <clears throat> now, you have to say that it's speaking that they didn't know they were Aiden, they were captured. Or else, else why are they gaining? If you look at Taisvis, the, the bottom line of Taisvis, they don't know they're Aiden, even though they don't know they're Aiden. And they think it's a Pesha Asa, meaning they Mamish think that no, they, they, they don't know they're Aiden, they were captured. They're coming and giving us that information. Nonetheless, since we have Aiden, you don't say a Pesha Asa. Pesha Asa is only when it's not Aiden. However, if each one goes ahead and testifies on the other, Hari Elun and Manas, they believe. Okay, this is a very important point. We have Adam over here that they captured. We don't have Adam that what they were they were violated. We say stam that what that if you're in the ju- jurisdiction of a guy that you would be violated. But let's say each one said on the other one that they they, they weren't violated that they're tahar, they would be believed because this is the kayach of Bezdin. Just like Bezdin gave the kayach for an isha or an eved or to go ahead and say that the husband died. Mishumiguni kilbara bonan. Let's take us back to our Yuvamis days, right? It's a tremendous cooler that women who people who are not acceptable for Adis would be accepted by what? By by Isha, by uh Ashes Ish, who are then by Shfuya were Mekel as well. So even though you have Aiden they're captured, if each one would testify on the other, it's like two Adam saying you're Tahar. So two dinam in the Mishnah. One, even though they don't know the Adam there, and you think there's a Pesha Asa. Kemashma, if there's Adim, there is no Pesha Asa. Conversely, if they say on each other, even if there's Adim, they're captured and they testify to each one's tar, not themselves, but they would believe on the other ones. Okay, to, the next piece of Gemara is it can be a bit confusing, but we're going to go through it with this. We all can see this? Yeah, okay. The Gemara is going to give four scenarios, guys. The Gemara is going to give four scenarios. She says she's Tamei, but my, her friend's Tahar. She says she's Tahar, but her friend is Tamei, the opposite. She says, I and my friend are both Tamei. She says, I and my friend are both Tahar. Those are the four scenarios. Good? Now, question. What is she believed on and what is she not believed on? Good? So now, the first case must be speaking their Aiden. Watch what happens. 
Nemon she Tamea. She's believed she's Tamea. Now, guys, if there's no Adim, if there's no Adim, right? If there's no Adim, it doesn't make a difference whether Adim or not. We have the din of Shavya al Nafshei, Chaticha di Sura, correct? Ani Tamea, I'm Tamea. So she would be Shavya al Nafshei, Chaticha di Sura, whether Adim or not, right? We don't care. However, she says, my friend is Tahar, right? She would be believed on our friend. Nemenesh, Chaveri Tahira. She's believed. She's believed, okay? She's believed. Why? Because the, the Chachamim gave the Kayach of belief. So this din, straightforward. She's believed that she's Tamei, Shavei Anafshei Chetich Sura. She's believed that her friend is Tahar, because again, the, they were Mekel by Edis Shvuyin that you believe. That's the first scenario. The next three are the ones the Gemara discusses. The, this is called the Reisha. This is the, the middle case, and this is the Seifa. So this is the Reisha, the Reisha, and this is the Reisha. I'm Tahar, and my Chaver is Tamea. So the 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 case the, 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 the price is going to say, Eina Nemenes Tahira. She's not believed to say she's Tahar. Now why isn't she believed? Isn't this a Pesha Asa, guys? Guys, she's saying. I was captured and I'm Tahar. Why is she not believed? So it must be, it's speaking that what? Yesh Aden. It must be there's Aden that she's captured. And therefore she's not believed. Of course, there's Aden. So therefore, Aden and Menashi Tahira is because you can't say Pesha Asa because there's Aden. Okay? Now, Aden and Menes, we don't need her. <laughs> Once there's Aden that she's captured, to say her friend is Tamea, we don't need her at all. Like, good. Everyone got that case? You don't say Pesha Asa because Yesh Eidim. And in this case, forget it. To say it Tamea is no Chiddush. Now, the second case, the middle case, Ani B'chaveira say Tamea. I and my Chave were both Tamea. So what's the din? She's believed on herself. Shavya al Nafshei Chaticha di Sura. Einanem Menes she's not believed on her friend and her friend is Tahar. Now, if there's Aden that they were captured, why would her friend be Tahar? Ella must be what? There are no Aden. It must be there are no Aden. And therefore she's not believed what? On her friend. Right. Next. Ani v'chaveri Tahira. I and my friend are Tahar. I and my friend are Tahar. She's not believed on herself. Why? I l'chayra shavya nafshei must be yesh edim, and nemenes shechaveri tahira. Why? Why is she? Why is she believed to say a friend is tahar? Because if you testify in somebody else, of course you always believe. Those are the three criteria, guys. One, pesha asa. Two, shavya nafshei. Three, nemenes to testify that someone's tahar as long as it's not yourself, as long as it's not yourself. Okay, I'm gonna leave this up. And now let's go through the Gemara with this chart. Here's going to be the question of the Gemara, guys. How could it be? This usually there's a consistency in a brisa. Here yesh edim, here ain edim, then yesh edim. Correct. So that's going to be the problem. So the Gemara is going to answer you right. That's the only way to learn pshat in this brisa. Rav Papa is going to learn pshat in the brisa that's all yesh edim, and then the, then we'll, we'll, we'll discuss that when we get there. Okay. So let's see what we got. Tanrabanan. Ani Tamea, the Chavira say Tahira. There's the Reisha, the Reisha. I'm Tamei, and my Chav is Tahira. The Din is Nemenesh. She's believed on both. She's believed on both. Good. Ani Tahira, the Chavira say Tamea, Eino Nemenes. Ani the Chavira say Tamea, the third case with both Tamei, Nemenes Alatsam, Eino Nemenes Al Chavira sa. Ani the Chavira say Tahira, Nemenes Al Chavira sa, Eino Nemenes Alatsma. Now, Oma Mar. Oh, right, going back over the brisa. Amama, ani tahira, the chavira say tamea, ainu nemenes. This guys, we're going to this case number two. Ani tahira, the chavira say nemenes. Now tamea, she's not believed that she's tahira. Why not? Why don't we say a peshasa? Fred the Gemara, heki dami, idelak like a edim al atzma amaylo mehimna. Right, nishbesi v'tahira ani ka'amrin. She's saying that what? I was captured and I'm tahar. That means that what? That a pesha asa, who a pesha hit her. She got a pesha asa, guys. Ella pshita dika edim. Look at the chart. It must be speaking yesh edim. Good. So in other words, 
because she's not believed over here, you're forced to say yesh edim. Because if there's no edim, this she has a pesha asa. She should be she should be tahira. Good. Next case, ema mitziasa. The second case. That's the case of number three. Ani becharasi temeya. Ani becharasi temeya. Nemenes al atzma. She's believed on herself. Beinu nemenes al chaverasa. Now, if there's edim, right? It, nemenes on herself that she's temeya. But if there's Adim, why is she, then she then a friend should be why was she in an menace to have rest of Hira? She's saying a friend's Tamea, correct? Why if there's Adim, why should we why why would she think that the friend is Tar? You got Aiden that she was captured. Ella must be that why there's no Adim, says the Gemara. If there's Adim, why is she not believed to say a friend's tar? There's Aiden that was captured, and she's saying the friend is Tahar. Must be speaking in Aiden. El Pshita Deleka Aiden. It must be there's no Aiden in that place. Seifa, the last case. Ani Vechaverase Tahiro, we're both Tahar. Nemenes al Chaverasa, and Nemenes al Atma. She's believed on herself, but she's not believed on her friend. Now, if there's no Aiden, Atma, why is she not believed on herself? It's a Pesha Asa. El must be El Pshita Deka Aiden. Ratio of a safer dicker adem, it's the us of the lecker adem. So the ratio, meaning case number two, is yesh adem. Case number three, case number four, yesh adem. And it's the us, case number three, ain't adem. I'm gonna buy you in. Ratio of a safer dicker adem, it's the us of the lecker adem. Guys, how is that? Yes, good. Right, right in front of you. It's mamish right in front of you. Right in front of you. Again, the three variables Pesha Asa, Shavi Anafshe. And then monis on a friend, the mockum that what that you captures for you. Rav Papa is now going to say it's speaking with her all Adam. Rav Papa Ama Kula Deke Adam. They're all Adam. So what's the now? So we have to figure out this case. These, these the last two cases. Kulam Deke Adam. The Ike Eid Echad. There's an Eid Echad Deke Apech. In other words, whatever she's saying, there's two Adam saying what she's saying. But there's now an eight echad saying the opposite of what she's saying. Omrani Tameya Bhakarasi Tahira, case number one. Now case number one. She says I'm Tamei. Khaverim says she's Tahar. And she says, Khav Tahar, you have eight on both. Bamala eight echad at Tahira Bhakavecha Tameya. You are Tahar and your friend is Tameya. E Shavli Nashi Khatikadi Sura. Khaverta Mishtaya Apumadida. So she is Shavi Anavshe. She says Tameya, even though the Eid Echad is saying not, she's believed she's Tamei. She is the Eid Echad only is one, guys. When she says on her friend that her friend is Tahar, she has the Kayacha two. It's two versus one. Therefore, she's a man and the right to say that's Tahar. I need to hire a case number two. I need to hire a Bechavirasa Tameya. I am Tahar. And my friend is Tameya. Biyama la Eid Echad, no. At Tameya Bechavirasa Tahira. Since there's Adim, love called Kamina. She doesn't have the ability to say she's tar. Since there's Adim that's saying that she was captured. She doesn't have a Pesha Asa. And a friend is going to be what? Is going to be free because the Eid Echad says the friend was, again, she said to Meya, the Eid Echad said the friend is tar. So the Eid Echad is believed like two. Case number three. Ani bechavresi to Meya. I my chavere to Meya. Therefore, she's Tamea. And the one aid that says that the friend was what was Tahar is believed. Says If that's the case, that's the exact same case as the Resha. And the aid is believed as one. So really, she says she's when she said Tamea, she really is Tahira. The way she said this is Thomas Nafshi and Polishtim. She wants to get her friend into trouble. So she figures she's more believable if she also says she's the mayor. Right? Uh, he, the of the Kamash Blon, that she's really the mayor. Ani Just one second. Okay, so a pup is saying again, you have one eight echad, connected all of them, and let's uh, 
Ani bechavrasi tahira, the final case. I am a chavra tahar. Ba'amala eid echad at bechavra temeya. E you keep in the ikka eidim lav kol kamina to say that she's tahar. Chavra said mishtaya pumadi da. But when she said the friend is tahar, that she has says mah sulamali hainu reisha the reisha. That's case number one. So ma'adu teimik kimi him the b'makam the pasul nafsha. When she believed that's case number one, when she passes herself, Abu Makan the Maksha Nafsha, which is the case where she's going to be Tahar, Amalem him that she's not believed, Kamash Mulan, that even there she watched she's believed. Okay, very good shmak. I wish everyone a good Shabbos. Mites of Shabbos, we're going to try for, uh, I guess it was 9 45 too early. I guess 10 o'clock will work out. Something like 10 o'clock is better, 9 45. Listen, watch watch this, watch the thing. We'll get a bearing when Shabbos is over. So watch the chat. Wish everyone a great Shabbos. Thank you.